guys, Mandy here with the world's youngest brony. Say hi. hi. <laughs> He's wearing his sister's shirt because they don't make brony shirts in little boy sizes. It's your hat. Who's on that hat? Rainbow? Dash. It's Dash, yeah. <laughs> We're gonna watch Cutie Mark Crusaders. We are the Cutie Mark Crusaders. On a quest to find out who we are. Let's see, what have they tried? Chicken, candy one, and a pig one. What do you see? A pig right here. And it makes check, 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 check. That's right, they crossed them all off. Hey, there's a car. There's a fire. There's a car. There's a car. <laughs> For Back to the Future Day. There has no cutie one. He's so cute. <laughs> He's one of my favorites. Can you say Pip Squeak? It's Pip Squeak. My little pony, my little pony. Ah, ah. Hey, this Princess Twilight. Is she your favorite? Yeah. Our playground equipment took quite a beating during Twilight's battle with Tyrek. <laughs> to say the least. This wing go off. Visual appeal. I thought only princesses got to have stained glass windows. Statue of her in the center of our schoolyard. Hey, no pulling manes. Or those freakish large teeth in your face. Big teeth are said to be a good thing because they help you look young for a long time. Just so you know. You could probably win this election if you show them all you feel. I don't recall asking you to speak. <gasps> That's so rude. It's the first time I've ever seen Silver Spoon suggest being nice, though. <laughs> Tony President is Pip Squeak! I couldn't have won without the hard work of my campaign managers, the Cutie Mark Crusaders! How many minutes are we at? Like the shortest episode ever. Oh, there has no Cutie Mark! Trust me, Diamond Tiara, Pip won. There and no Charlie's like, tiara. that's enough. You wanna know how? Sorry, I'm not allowed to speak. You tell her, girlfriend! Yeah. Oh no. Just cause she's never cared about oh no. We're going to forgive her, aren't we? Jeez, that nose. That's what happens when you're stuck up. Your nose just gets totally deformed. So just some bad parenting right there. Song number three. He's not a pony anymore. She's, a, she's still a pony. She's so sad though. She needs some friends. I know! Super Reader can help them feel better! <laughs> the Super Readers are gonna help her. <laughs> I don't know, I think the Crusaders are gonna help her. Oh, uh, dash. There's no dash in this episode, buddy. Sorry. You get to explore all these options. Learning who you really are before you're stuck with something you don't understand. Saber's gonna be happy about that. He has issues with the whole cutie mark idea. <laughs> That's a weird question. <laughs> the face! <laughs> that damn face! Can you make that face? <laughs> we call that the potty dance. I was at the school board meeting and they didn't approve my request for the new playground equipment. Like taking the shade off of your lamp and all of a sudden all the dead bugs fall out of it. You know you're better than some serious faith right there. I grew up with horses. I ain't never seen a horse run backwards. I can tell you, I'd follow the rainbow. I wanted something you don't have. Friends! Cutie oh. Mark. These are the Cutie Mark Crusaders, and they are my friends. <laughs> Since when? <laughs> Since like two seconds ago. Here's my grocery list. My talent is getting other ponies to do what I want. Using my leadership skills for good. Oh. Aww. Okay. You're so cute. All of a sudden, she's organizing like Twilight. Those balls are gonna get real twisted up. He's the happiest pony. Nice playground. 
We spent an awful lot of time fussing and fretting, trying to discover our true talent, but when we take a little time off, we end up helping other ponies figure out their true talent. Lesson learned. Aww, best friends. What happened to her? What's happening to her? What's happening?